with land to map you can insert references such as DWG, DGN, PDF or images. Here we are with a DWG. Then you have to activate the Elmer transformation. Here we are in local coordinates, as you can see. Then you have to identify a point in the reference. And we will take a point here with our GPS. And boom, our XREF is immediately translated. You can add more pairs to your transformation and you can see the precision of the points just on the top of the ribbon. You can be more precise and add more pairs. Just before validating the calculation, you have a table with all the information about the calculation. With the background map, you have more precision when you work. And in addition, you have a real-time position, so it's really easy to work. Here, use the copy function to do this. Your work will become more reliable. You can also add blocks to your map. You can easily adjust the opacity of your reference. So it's easier for you to know which objects are from the reference or not.